to our final race of week seven. It's a two mile five. Ormwick Mayor's Hunters Chase. Astro Dunal Francis from Martin Leon is a top weight number one. Stormwatch for Leon Van Rensburg is two. Balladella Mayor for Alex Cherry is three. Cleo Patra for Paul Rose is four. Amersmith Long Tana for Ryan Costa is five. And Astro Mensa for Alex Cherry is six. So just six of them here to go over this extended two miles and a half. A couple of bigger trainers in here. Stormwitch is a. a uh, Oh, he's gone, Storm Witch. Um, I was just about to say he was a, he's quite a good chase, um, hurdler, but uh, he's, he's slotted down into this under chase, and he just thought, I'm not going to jump, and he threw himself into the fence. Unlucky there for Leon. As we go over the second of the 16, we're going to be led by Ballad de la Mer, followed through by Amasis Lontana. Fight back five lengths back to Cleopatra, Astro Arm Glances, and Astro Mensa. So it's a... It's a race with astrological, astrological, what sort of word is that? With, um, anyway, horses with the word astro to begin with. But we're being led by Ballad de la Mer. Um, Smith Lontana in second, Cleopatra is third. Astro Mensa and Astro Charm Glances. And two at the rear. Over the fourth of Urpo jump by Astro Mensa. Lucky to still be on his feet. They're inside the two miles now. And it's Bella de la Mer from Cleopatra and Amasis Lontana. We'll get some money here if they all make it round. And take the fifth. Cherry looking to pick up double prize money here. He's got two still standing. Never know. We get to the six. All over it, although Anna Smith Lontana made a little bit of a mistake. Drops back from his uh, share of second position. All in single file, as you can see. Alex Cherry bookending the race with Bella de la Mer and Astronanza. And between those two, it's Cleopatra, Anna Smith Lontana, and Astro of Arm Glances in that order. We go past the winning post of a mile and a half to go here at Ulwick. From Brea. But it's Ballad de la Mer from Cleopatra and Anna Smith Lontana. About four back to Astro Trump, Astro Charm Glances and Astro Mensa. Still, although Cleopatra's within her length now, and then a Sith Montana, the length of that, and about four back to maybe five to Astro Time Glances. Astro Mensa is a couple of lengths even further back, but uh, it's as we were, no real change. We're getting a little bit closer to the leader. We go over the tenth, still on their feet, and we're inside the final mile. And it is Ballad de la Mer from Cleopatra and Emma Smith Lontana. Astro Triumph Glances is about five lengths back from that. And even further back is Astro Mensa at the moment. We get to the 11th. Leaders all over it, a couple of slower jumps from all. But Emma Smith Lontana now, looking to challenge Ballad de la Mer on his own. Cleopatra sitting pretty. Oh, we've lost him. Ballad de la Mer has gone. The leader's gone. He's been there all the time. That's left Amersmith Lontana on his own up front. Well, and Costello must be uh, itching his feet here, looking for his first win at the National Hunt. I'm pretty sure he's uh, he already won his first flat race this week. Well done to Ryan. But it's Amersmith Lontana that leads from Astro Charm Glances. It looks very ominous. Cleopatra and running on now is Astro Mensa as they go to the 13th. There's only four of them here, and Emma Smith Lontana's under a bit of pressure now as Astro Charmer Glances just cruises on by. It's unfortunate for Ryan, but it's Astro Charm Glances. Oof, says go, and he's gone. 
inside the final three. So Astra Charm glances, takes a 5 6 length advantage away from Astra Mensa that's run on well. Cleopatra may well have left this a little bit too late as Am Smith and Montana drifts back. So they go to the 14th, that's three from home. So it's Astra Charm glances, leads by about 5 to 6 to Astra Mensa and Cleopatra are going to fight out second and third, gets to the penultimate, gets over it well, as does a remainder. So Astra Charm glances, he's got this in the pocket, he gets over the last, the jockey's even taken a hold on him. I want that handicap to go flying high, but I think with this advantage win, as he gets over the last from Cleopatra and Astromancer, we're going to fight it out for second place. So it's a comfortable win for Astro Charm Glances, Martin Leadham's second win of the day, I've seen. Cleopatra just gets up for second, Astromancer was third, and Emma Smith Lontana was fourth. That's your one, two, three, four, that's the last race of the week. And uh, we'll all see you for week eight. He was the 9 to 4 favourite. He dropped 97. He won't be in a hunter's chase next week. <laughs> For Martin Leadham, second was Cleopatra. For Paul Rose, third was Astro Mance for Alex Cherry. Fourth was. Ah.